Japan. I think y'all might be able to convert the stock stick job into a little more than just uh, fight. <laughs>
have um, a medallion for the winner of the Inner Brody Artisan Competition. It was made by a fellow member from the Barrier Energy, Don, and the chain was provided by yet another member from the area of Okay. So, congratulations. Um, Thank you. Thank you. Every year, the Order of the Laurel sponsors a Persona Pentathlon, and this is rather like an Ironman competition. Um, each entrant must enter five items uh, from three different categories so you have to step out of your comfort zone for most people um, and it's hard y'all it's really hard <laughs> just telling you so this year we had six entrants one two three six yes no six okay here we go uh, if you're here, if you're still here, if you would um, stand up and let people know that you actually, that you entered this, it's a lot of work for folks, it really is. Uh, the difference between the number one and number two was like less than this many points. <laughs> it was very, very, very close. <coughs> But our winner this year is um, Sir Jocelyn Otome. It is important for a Laurel, for a uh, somebody who's entering this competition, to be well ornamented, and so. Beauty has agreed to join me. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell my wife. We have, um, this is a symbolic basket of a few of the things that were, uh, are part of the prize. There's a big bag back there, but you don't need this. I'll put it in my car. <laughs> There's a big bag of more stuff. So, and thank you very much. And thank you to all the laurels who judged. We appreciate it. Next year's coordinator, I have to big thank you, is um, Mistress Ranvig. Ranvig. I'll get it right, um, is going to be taking over this competition next year. So please give her a big hand. For Hi, I'm Baroness Willow of the Mystery Ingredients Tribal Challenge. And if you're not familiar with it, please become familiar with it. It is a challenge that makes every artisan think outside the box. And today was no exception. Um, we had some wonderful entrants, all from different places. Um, one thing about my challenge is that there are very few rules. You just have to use whatever I sent you. Mm -hmm. And today we really had someone who um, brought forward the request, which was show us a memory of the SCA to, to us. And Lady Tia, would you please come forward? You're on board. to choose my successor. 
We had two entrants, if you could both rise. We have Eric and Seamus. Between the two of them, they brought ten different beverages. And uh, the, judging, uh, the judging team, consisting of myself, Master James Burlaston, and both of their majesties, had a great deal of pleasure tasting things from both of you, and they both did very well. As I was busy afterwards, I did not know who Her Majesty selected. Uh, Her Majesty tells me that Lord Seamus. Token, every royal brewer needs the ability to take small samples of many things that will be handed to them without getting too drunk. So I give you a mug. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
much. <laughs> and um, I uh, said, Bob, we're going to charge you. Brought <laughs> 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 everything down. Uh, here's two changes. Uh, there's a new brewer. And, <laughs> and uh, we need that information, y'all. We, we need that information. Chronicler at amanda.ca.org. Please send us your information. <laughs> And um, I, I'll send you one more time. So, about to try to get there. And um, Adina is uh, And we just want to say thank you so much for your service. You have done a great justice. And we'll miss you. Fairness Adina. <laughs>
Lady Thea Dines, present yourselves before their majesties.
I say, I need help with this scroll, and you're like, me, 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 me. Even when maybe you shouldn't take on things because you're super busy and uh, the work you do is beyond beautiful. I know for a fact that it seems everyone wants to come to you for a period scroll, and when that starts happening, you definitely made it somewhere. Here, in fact. Yeah. And yeah, so what we're going to bestow upon you today has an IOU scroll with it from any scribe that you can that you want, and that's on Duke Ragnar. <coughs> okay. <laughs> anything, but he wanted to make sure that you got the scroll that you wanted. So, today, His Majesty and I, we're going to walk up here because I think I, I want to be closer to you when I say this. His Majesty and I would like to make you a baroness of our court. <laughs> Give it to someone else. <laughs> you want a leader? 
downstairs? Yeah, I'd better meet you downstairs. This was the Herald's photo. Their Majesties seek any for whom this is their very first event. Any newcomers? Kind of unique to one of our kids. It's, you're seeing just a different side. The, uh, the beauty instead of the beast of the society. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Uh, anyone ever call you a beast? <laughs> <laughs> Probably. <laughs> we, we like to call our newcomers into to our courts to say thank you for being here and that we cannot wait to see, see you come back. And Ms. Maxine and I would like to give you our tokens as a way of saying thank you for being here. And you, this one right here brought me a gift basket for my corgis today. <laughs> There's some hiding back here. There's some hiding. Oh, they are right here. Oh, oh. They push their friends <laughs> forward. Yeah. They brought, they brought the newcomers. Oh, you oh. brought the newcomers? Here, well, let, have one of my personal <laughs> Absolutely just 
done to me. I, yeah. <laughs> it absolutely stunned me. And I am so sad that I have not been able to just ask you a million more questions like I asked today. I, I probably stood at your just asking the most random questions about the most random things and you absolutely took every moment to answer every question I had, even when you probably thought this girl had lost her mind. <laughs> I got you, Geeky. <laughs> sure. Uh, am I ever? <laughs> no, no, please, please go ahead. I just wondered why would you send it to anybody to you as your chance to send it to I don't think she's been properly prepared. I don't think she's been properly prepared either. Would you like to hear that? Yeah. yeah. Call yeah. those people up here? Would you? Yeah. I'll call them people. <clears throat> Their Majesties seek audience for the most noble order of the world. and party for you in your home barony, maybe Ruby Jaffs. I am so excited to have you represent us, but even more so now that you get to wear that medallion around your neck. <laughs> Do you have any business that needs to take place? Do you have any constraints, or are you clear to give fealty to the Crown?
had time to rehearse. <laughs> For Mistress Cat, <laughs> our arts and science champion at Gulf Wars, and the newest member of the Order of the Laurel. <laughs> Please see me so that I might get your names and your mundane names. 